Hey, Rupert. How you doing? Hey, Rupert. Hey. So are you ready to uh, swim with some alligators? Welcome to Florida. <laughs> no alligators. I mean, the sharks are pretty bad. But the the sharks, are, yeah, you know, sharks, they, they oh, come up in. you should see in. the, you should video the um, Do you all, do anybody bring steps. a mask? Go. Go. <laughs> go. 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 Just like I sent her and you in, at, in Chiang Mai to the, hold the baby tiger, but I was too scared. To do That's it. right. She sent her daughter in with the baby tiger. I was too scared to go in. So Rohan got new boots. He's, he's uh, sporting these. The dinosaur boots. He's excited about them. It's like a little fire barrel. A flame barrel. So sweet. This is our first of the season. All right. So hey, right. you're here for it. Woohoo! <laughs> I'm like trying to figure it out. <laughs> we gotta regroup. Hey, I didn't realize there was gonna be a camera in my face. I've kind of gotten used to the camera not being around. How does it feel with it being back? <sighs> Normal. Wow, it's really bright out there. Oh, do you need some help uh, carrying some of that stuff? <laughs> Independent woman. <laughs> I'm your cameraman. <laughs> there you there go. You know. Hey, I'd rather have crew. I don't know. No. <laughs> On second thought, no. <laughs> so I hurt my foot. I've uh, started exercising in the mornings. Yeah, I have this dumb idea for an exercise. I want to try free running. Been inspired by Mujahid back in India. I'm just like running across these little parking blocks in the morning, trying to see if I can keep my balance while I run. I've twisted a couple times. Now I can feel like a little something in my foot. This is that's me, you know, starting any sort of exercise regime. Just uh, from the beginning, messing myself up. Yeah. That's the way I do things. Hi. Hi. So, oh, so yeah, she got barnacled. She got barnacled uh, last night. So. Oh. Yeah. How does it feel to be barnacled? Well, it's a new experience. Not fun. Are you gonna turn into like some sort of superhero or supervillain now? You know, Most like Spider-Man. You'll be Barnacle Girl. <laughs> That's a terrible name. I'll be something cooler than that. Don't worry. Okay. Oh, Barnacle Girl. <laughs> who, are, who are you? Uh, Captain to America. Gee, I, I, I totally didn't I know. Don't what know what it is. I don't know. Like Turkish Airlines, still on the bag. I know. You That's still the Sue's keep way pulling right them there. off, uh, little bit by bit. Fam. We are taking this to this at Grandpa's house. All right. You, are you gonna miss me when I'm when you're gone? Yes. I'll oh. miss you. Oh, thanks. Nice of you. Dada, you know, kiss. Oh. Uh, uh, um, uh. Uh, this Eskimo oh, kiss. Oh, oh, Eskimo kiss. Wow. Okay. Eskimo oh, kiss. Yeah. <laughs> I think I'm going to try 331 all the way. Oh my gosh. You and your alternate roots. Kiss for the camera. No, I don't really want to kiss for the camera. This no, is going to be. All right. Mm, bye. Censored. <laughs> My grandmother instituted this thing uh, way back. I mean, that's since I was bef before I was even in the picture. Uh, we call it the Smith Send Off. Grandmother's name was Smith. So, this is the Smith Send Off. Waving to someone. And the, the idea is to wave as long as they're still in sight. Smith Send Off. 
I think I've actually shown this on a video before. Having Smith send off to my wife and kids, though, for a very long time. So my new job, I can't afford to, I'm doing some video editing, so I can't afford to have the kind of laissez-faire style that I have in my vlogs a lot of the time uh, with color correction and that kind of thing. I'm just like, hey, color, schmuller, it doesn't really work when you're dealing with clients, right? So, I don't know. Color correction might be my least favorite part of the entire process, so. Uh, but what's really cool is uh, in Adobe Premiere's latest incarnation, they have a lot better tools than they used to. I mean, really, truly, if you're gonna be color correcting something, you need a third program, I guess a second program, use DaVinci Resolve or something. It's just like learning an entirely new language. You, I mean, this, this is somebody's job in Hollywood, you know, it's being a colorist. Whenever I do it, it just looks, <laughs> it looks bad. <laughs> But I've learned a lot from uh, editing photos, on, ironically, for Instagram using Adobe Camera Roll. Uh, just relearning some of that. So it's good. Maybe some of that will spill over to some of these. And uh, it'll look better. We'll see. So that's about it for this week. I will be uploading more vlogs. They'll probably be a little bit shorter, kind of like this. I have some more flashback material from the preceding weeks that hasn't made it into a video yet. And I am uploading to Instagram and Snapchat every now and then, so check there. Real videos will be coming back sometime. I did hope to have the next episode of American Indian ready by the end of September. It doesn't look like, well, I mean, it didn't happen doesn't look like it's gonna happen it didn't happen it's October 3rd do want to have it up this month for sure and I want to kind of start having a dialogue with you viewers who are still here about what the future of this channel is gonna look like I'm thinking about starting a podcast that uh, may be what takes over where American Indian left off that way I can still talk to people in India uh, but won't have to deal with the b-roll as much it'll be more of a conversation and we can talk about creativity and culture but it won't, we won't be able to actually make it like travel show kind of documentary stuff. So that's kind of an idea I'm toying around with. I've got a voice for radio, right? It's like podcasting does kind of make sense. Uh, so that's something, uh, I mean, I'm not quitting the channel, but that's something I can do on the side kind of to take over where American Indian left off. I think we can get into some pretty interesting topics with that. Uh, I don't really want to get political. I'd rather keep it creative, cross-cultural, and constructive. I know I have a tendency to rant on this channel. I have done quite a bit of it in the last month or two. Yeah, I don't really want to go that route in the future with the channel. Uh, I'm not really wanting to get into politics. So keeping focus on music and movies and, and art and culture, these kind of things that are good for me, that don't make me want to rant. So that's something. Uh, still just not ready to do movie reviews. Honestly, uh, I just don't really have time to watch that many movies right now with the new job. So that's about it. Until next time, keep it creative, keep it cross-cultural, and keep it constructive, YouTube. Thank you very much. Oh, one last thing. We hit 45,000 subscribers, so thank you so much for all, the, all of you who are still here. And for those of you who have newly subscribed, uh, new directions for this channel in the future. But I do want to hear your feedback, and I'm, I'm thankful that you're here and that you've uh, stuck around, <laughs> around with this channel for this long. And uh, I do want to hear what you think the future of the channel can look like. All right, thank you.